This is the Logitech's K780 multi-device keyboard. It allows you to connect up to three devices via Bluetooth or Logitech's unifying USB system. It will work on a Mac, a Windows, with your tablet, your phones, pretty much any device that allows a Bluetooth connection. This keyboard works extremely well, especially when you pair it with Logitech's Triathlon M720 mouse, which also allows a connection up to three devices. I'll be doing a review of this mouse in the coming weeks. I'm just gonna keep this review nice, short, and simple. I'm gonna give you five cons and five pros to this very keyboard. Starting with the cons, number one, no rechargeable batteries. Logitech states that you can get up to two years on one set of two AAA batteries. If it gets anywhere close to this, I will make this concession. Number two, it's not backlit. I'm sure this helps extend the battery life, but I would sacrifice a little battery life, especially if it's two years for a backlit keyboard. Number three, there's no light indicator on the cap locks or the num locks keys. So you don't know whether they're on or off until you start typing. Number four, the arrow key placement. They move these keys to shrink the keyboard a little bit underneath the shift key. I'm starting to get used to that. Number five, I have it at number five, but it's probably my number one, just from a Mac user perspective. It's the placement of the function and the control keys. For Mac users, these are in reverse location. The function key should be on the outside with the control key being on the inside. Now on to the pros. I, I limited it to five. May have cheated and crammed a couple of them together because they were similar, uh, but there are many that I could go on and on about. But here are my top five pros for this particular keyboard. Number one, the keys feel great. Good response, good travel, uh, good feel to the overall keyboard. Number two, easy setup, adding new devices. Just press and hold the number until the light starts blinking and then you can connect it to another device. Uh, the switching of the Bluetooth is also very quick. There's no delay pressing the button and then you can start immediately typing on the other device. Number three, there's a tray to hold your tablet and phone. It's a slight negative because you can't adjust the angle and the tray is not adjustable so it probably won't support your phone's phone case. Number four, solid build. This does not feel like a cheap plastic keyboard at all. Weighing in at almost two pounds, the weight is needed to give you the confidence to let it hold your tablet and phone without fear of it tipping over. Number five is the compactness of a keyboard with a numerical keypad. I did list it as a number five because they moved the arrow keys, but it's also a pro in this because now I can put this keyboard into my backpack and fully close the zipper. I've been using this keyboard now for over a month and I highly recommend it. It is now my go-to keyboard. I love it. Uh, and now that it fits in my backpack, I'm also contemplating it, taking it back and forth with me to work. Put links in the description below to this keyboard. And if you want to check out the review of this mouth, watch this video here.